Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass Hero, and welcome to Mogeko Castle Part 2. Previously on Mogeko Castle, we encountered a bunch of cat people who looked a bit like Giko, the Japanese ASCII art, and they were also quite rude to say the least. Um, I think the reason you can't see in front of you is, uh, your hair and you have no eyes, but... Sprite wise, he looks a lot like our son from uh, the Monogatari series. It's also got that kind of little ahoge thing going. Smiling while trapped. Moi gege. Fuck you. Hey, fuck you, Leverhead. You think this is a motherfucking game?
we fought about lewd things so much that we didn't notice that she clearly walked around us and locked the door. Oh, a prosciutto. Perhaps if we collect all seven prosciutto, we can summon the legendary dragon and wish for our freedom. Or wish to be really rich. That also is pretty good. No, I don't think you should try to wake up. I think you should probably take this at face value. Let's see. Oh, prosciutto! Mmm, product of the gods. Oh, there's more. I, I don't know what I'm doing with them, but I'm collecting them. I'm gonna doubt go right. Hey, look, there's a, uh, Mo Gecko. I'm gonna get the prosciutto first. The trash can, filled with puke. I, I got some garbage. I got some puke here. The conclusion to a tale of much tragedy. Mysterious shelves. Is it said only darkness lies within? Oh. Can I just keep collecting them until I get bored? I'm gonna see what's gonna happen. I might be here for a while. There! I've collected 99 prosciutto, which is the cap of prosciutto. And I can collect red pepper. And see when it's sold in potato chips. A note written in blood. A paper for table turning. It has blood on it for some reason. Yummy prosciutto! Praise be to prosciutto. The prosciutto is a heavenly father, much like the sun. Yeah, I'm uh... a. <laughs> ah, oh, it feels good. I didn't even need it. I had 99 of them. It just felt like taking it anyway. Someone's been shopping for Amazon a lot. Which Amazon Prime box do I want to hide in? Okay. A cardboard box. Yeah, remember that trick? That's a sneak I remember. Damn, 
He managed to order one of those by using his Amazon Prime account, which only costs $79.99. That corpse is fine too, just like a cat. Don't forget to pray for Goku. I think that guy's flying on Frylock or something. Potato chips are so moe. I feel like if you guys weren't constantly trying to make- have your way with me, then, uh... I feel like you'd be really rad people to party with. Oh, a note magically appeared over here. Reveal this to me. To whomever should read this letter, by the time you read this, I am surely gone. This castle is dangerous. You must find some means of escape. If you cannot escape this place, you will never elude the Mogekos. They are persistent. Oddly, no matter where I hide, they'll always come right for me. Hide, and hide, and hide. They always find me soon enough. And I kill, and kill them. But there's no end. They come one after another. This is no more than a hypothesis. But perhaps they are... It seems they're back again. I know it's futile, but I won't run. While well, I can still move. I wanted to say a final goodbye to my daughter. I'm sorry I failed as a father. I love you, Olivia. So I reloaded a little bit just so I can check the other rooms. Hmm. A shopping list. Alfalfa, Timothy Grass, and Red Clover. Hey Fever, set me of my will to live. Goodbye. So that was the guy that we encountered later? No, like, they, just, they just probably all have hay fever or something. Ah, oh, murder mystery.
What the hell is that? Uh, I probably shouldn't question things here. Hmm. Okay, let's just loop back around. Uh, that's it for these areas. You will definitely die, but will you unleash its madness? I like that this game gives me an option if I want to kill myself. And I'm a very curious person. Holy, this is, this doesn't look too good. I think I'm gonna start running. Touch my summon sign, brother. And I will aid you in jolly cooperation. The voice came from the stairs? I guess these guys don't really... They're just, they're just camping out. They don't feel like they should attack me right now. He won't attack you. He'll just get close to you and help you. In hopes of winning your love. Hello, my name is a somewhat strange Mogeko. Hi, somewhat strange Mogeko. Yeah, I, I think I realized that a while back.
Take this knife. It's the key to succeeding in your adventure. Use it for, uh, CQC? Just on a whim, huh? Never mind, I'm gonna take your prosciutto. Food of the gods. Oh yeah, he looks he looks pretty handsome and young back then. Somewhat strange Mogiko's diary. Lots of records of masturbation and bowel movements. Not so strange. Oh! I don't think this Mogiko is somewhat strange. I think he's pretty normal for their standards. He's... How to speak... He's probably just read a lot of, uh... Interesting material, if he knows what I mean. And he's learned the concept of, uh... Foreplay. By their standards. A poem written by somewhat strange Mogiko. Cola. <laughs> uh, all the details are here. Cola and tequila. Somewhat strange Mogiko seems like a heavy drinker. So you're essentially a loner who just does nothing but drink cola with his tequila and various liquors, occasionally drinking tea, when I'm here anyway, and you, uh, you masturbate while reading porn, while waiting for a high school girl to come around, I, I see. Yeah, that's, I think I'll be going now. Alright, let's do some, uh, CQC. Oh my, one more, Shindeu. So after that nice little murder spree, I'm feeling pretty good about myself. I think we're gonna take a look around. That's connecting hallway. This is some more Amazon.co.jp. They seem to be not caring as long as I don't tell anyone what happened in there. Locked, huh? Also locked. Okay, so we only have one route to go. Hi there.
That's a spirit. With the power of determination, we'll defeat all these colonic masturbators. So that's it for part two of Mogeko Castle. I think if anyone's really confused by this game, um, the best way to interpret it is, is kind of like a very dark satire of otaku subculture. Like I said, the, the Mogekos are basically the Giko Cat, and that's very representative of, uh, Two Channel and all of them. They also go around using a lot of Two Chan memes and things like that, and they, some references to, like, doujins and stuff in there. Um, specifically, a cat is fine too is a really obvious one. There's some other more subtle ones. And that's just not translation, uh... That was probably in the original dialogue. One thing to know is, though, is that... When you see that kind of humor in a game like this, or anything like a manga or whatever... Japanese humor is usually very self-depreciative, and... You may think that the person writing this, the game creator, hates otaku and all that stuff. It's not really... It's more of... Self-insulting, I'd say. And you see, like, a lot of that in writing and stuff, uh... Entire stories just dedicated to it, like, Welcome to the NHK. Like, really, it's better to represent the main character not as a character itself, but more of a representation of, uh... Waifu subculture, I guess, and how people talk in those friends, like... Ah, ah, That kind of stuff like that. Now, I've actually seen some posts, because I used to surf around 2chan and places like that. Where they'll actually say almost some of those lines straight, just like that, uh... Ha ha... Ha schoolgirls, ha ha... Kinda like that. And they'll have the Geeko Cat there. Now as far as where the actual plot is going... Um, if I think a lot of this stuff isn't really real. Or it's... Always that kind of half real, half... Imaginary, exists in your mind kind of thing. That would explain why they know her name and... Why well, the other guy and other people are here, it's kind of like a, uh, like a psychological witch's house? That's, that's how I'm interpreting it anyway. So, giving into the darkness of the castle maybe is giving into your despair. We'll see anyway. Anyway, thank you all for watching, and stay tuned for part three of Mogeko Castle.